Sunday, nearing 80 degrees around I should around say here. the fountains, this fountain won't, open, won't start until May. Well, maybe we should flip it on a little early. I'm just going to, based idea. on the yeah. forecast, with near 80 degrees on Sunday, there'll right. be parts of the southwest suburbs that do make it in the 80s. Out there right now, though, we have temperatures ranging from 45 in Michigan City to about 62 in McHenry. Nothing all that heavy on the Doppler radar. This is mainly sprinkles, light rain, part of a system that's exiting out of the region to our south and east. But there's another system coming in out of places like Iowa and also Minnesota that will allow for another opportunity for some scattered showers, potentially even a brief thunderstorm. Nothing heavy, nothing really all that strong. But that's a look at future radar at 7 o'clock. That continues throughout the overnight. Highs today will be in the 50s. We're in the 40s for tonight. And then a little bit of rain early on tomorrow before that moves out. And we'll look for some clearing skies, gusty northwest winds, and high temperatures approaching 60 degrees. And then we get into your Saturday, which is looking fantastic. First, look at how much more additional rainfall we could see, potentially as much as four tenths of an inch down here around Kankakee, anywhere from about a few hundredths of an inch to maybe a third of an inch from Chicago up towards the North Shore. Let's talk about the weekend. Make your plans now. 70 degrees on Saturday, sunshine. Looking at 73 Ottawa, 65 degrees at the loop. And then Sunday's the warmest day at 79 degrees at O'Hare, 80 degrees now expected at Midway, 81 in Kinkakee and Joliet. A little bit cooler lakeside, but still beautiful weekend ahead with temperatures in the low 70s in the loop on your Sunday. So that's a check of the forecast. A little shower activity today, windy, clearing tomorrow. Beautiful weekend ahead. Want to give you a first alert, though, as we head into next week. Tuesday is a day to watch a storm threat some early indications that some thunderstorms on Tuesday could be on the severe side. So we'll be watching that in the days to come.